taste of the best goes round and round, round and round, round and round. Wheels of the bus goes round and round, all through the town. Hello kids, how are you all? Today we are going to see about vehicles. Children, which are the vehicles you have traveled? Car, bus, motorbike. Children, if you want to go from one place to another, how will you go? By walking or by car? If it is near, we can walk. But if you want to go far away places, what we do? Ask your mama and dada, how will you go? Come on Apu, how will you go? Ah, by your car or motorbike. Means of transport are very important in our life, isn't it? We use different means of transport to travel far away places and nearby places. If there is no means of transport, how would we go somewhere? For that, we use different types of vehicles. Vehicles help us to move from one place to another. They move on land, water and air. So children, which are the three means of transport? Come on. Yes, land, water, air. So first, land transport. We can travel on road by car, bus, cycle, motorbike, truck. They all move on wheels. Now, train. Train is another means of transport on land. It runs on rails or we call them track. We use land transport in our day-to-day -day life. Next, water transport. We can travel on water by a ship. Boat, yacht, ferry. Now, boats. Boats are used to travel small distance. Ship is used to travel long distance. It also carry people and also goods. Next is ferry. It carries Passengers over a short distance as a regular service. You know children, some ferry boats carry vehicles also. Air transport. We can travel in air by an aeroplane, helicopter, rocket, balloon. They are used to travel from one country to another. Air travel is the fastest means of transport. Rockets are used to go to space. Vehicles Little Chris is so fond of his toys that he is never tired of playing with them. Look, he has so many of them and all are vehicles. Chris, it's getting late. I think you must go to bed now.
Yes, Mama. Chris leaves his toys and goes to sleep. But as soon as Chris is asleep, his toys liven up. Look at all the toys coming to life. Then they quietly move past the sleeping Chris and out of the house. This is ambulance. This is a fire engine. Look at the truck. This is a jeep. Such a big balloon. Look at the aeroplane go. Oh, it's a rocket. What a car! Nice auto rickshaw! Ship! Amazing motorbike! Oh, a bullock cart. The vehicles enjoyed their night of freedom. But the next morning, when Chris went to play with his toys, they were all there just as he had left them. Identify and choose the correct vehicles. Rocket. Jeep Aeroplane Car Keep going Ship Bike Van Auto Rickshaw Keep Going Hot Air Balloon Train Bicycle Congrats! Children, using the different modes of transport, we can travel from one place to another. It's fun, right? I think you all like traveling, isn't it? I also like to travel by a car, by a motorcycle. And do you like cycling? Yes? Do you have cycle with you? Now take your textbook, page number 50. Match the vehicles to the images on the right. 
Can you see the first picture? Aeroplane. Aeroplane. Yes. Sky. Yacht. Yacht. Sea. Train. Train. On rails. Car. Road. Circle the beginning letter of the vehicles. Cycle. What is the beginning letter of cycle? C. Circle C. Car. C. Circle C. Now ship. Yes. Circle, yes. Aeroplane. A. Aeroplane. Train. What is the first letter of train? Yes. T. Boat. B. Circle, B. Bike. B. Circle, letter B. Now bus, yes, B, very good. Now quiz time, I'm going to ask you questions. Are you all ready? Okay, name a vehicle that can travel in air. Come on, yes. Aeroplane. Come on. Aeroplane. Now, name a vehicle that can travel on land. Come on. You can say any vehicle you like. Car. Bike. Truck. Very good. Now, name a vehicle that can travel in Water. Yes, come on children. Sheep, boat, ferry. Very good. Wheels on the bus goes round and round. Round and round. Round and round. So children, hope you all understood about vehicles. So, study well, do all your activities and send it to your teacher. See you in the next class. Bye.